Welcome back to daytime, everybody. Dr. Trina is here. She's here with the Advanced Chiropractic and Wellness Center. Sometimes my tongue doesn't move. Welcome to the show, Trina. Thank you. Thank well, you for having me. What we're looking at today is really the advancement in chiropractic care. So yes. what is the machine that we have in front of us? Well, this machine is really the latest technology in chiropractic, although the technology has been around for about 15 years. So what it does is it allows me to find exactly where the spinal fixations are with a computer. Okay. So what I would do is I would basically have the patient just like this, mm -hmm. and if we're going to assess her mid-back, perhaps, let's say, Okay. We would take this instrument, which is attached to the computer. So it's a very gentle tuning fork-like instrument, which uses okay. a piezoelectric sensor. And what I do is I essentially use a gentle clicking down the spine. So that's looking for the curvation, curvation of the spine? Would that that's be correct? Right. Well, it's more looking for the fixations in the spine. Okay. Because if you have stiffness in your spine, that can be the source of neck pain, back mm -hmm. pain, headaches, other, a whole other host of symptoms. So once we've objectively identified the areas of fixation or stiffness, we can then treat the problem. problem. Now, looking at the computer screen, when you mm -hmm. did that little clicking, now it has this chart. That's right. Or a graph. Um, yes. What is that telling you? What can you see from what you just did? Well, each of those little waves represents the fixation in each of the vertebrae. So okay. if there is fixation, the shape of the waves will tell me whether or not the vertebra is stuck. And therefore, if the ver vertebra is stuck, it might be causing your back pain. So that hmm. way, once we've identified the areas, and that's all based on the shape of the waves there, without yeah. getting to the physics yeah. behind it, but what we do then is now we use the same instrument to do the treatment as okay. well as finding oh. out what the problem is. So after we set up the settings, it's all right there in the computer. I get right onto the vertebra that needs to be adjusted, mm -hmm. take the same instrument, and it's a very gentle tapping sensation. Wow. It scared me a little. Yeah. I know. It's a little bit of a scary sound. I can even show you on your hand here what it feels yeah, like. Yeah, no, that so would know. be great. Here, if you want to turn your palm over, okay. that's all it is there. Okay, so are you sending sort of pulsations into the spine to, wow. to readjust it, or how is it working? It's no x-rays, no ultrasound waves, or anything like that. The adjustment itself is the tapping sensation. Because okay. what it does is instead of the twisting or turning or cracking, it essentially taps in the vertebra into place until it moves better. Right. Which over time, when you keep up with this treatment, it really makes a huge difference. Yeah, absolutely. But it's less hard on the body. Yeah, well, there are just some patients who can't tolerate twisting or turning. Okay. Right. That's all it is, you know, especially some um, children are worried about their children or, you know, people in wheelchairs if we treat them because, again, they get back problems just like everyone mm -hmm. else and so it's very easy to get them up in the chair. And okay. so that way it's minimally invasive. So w would that be the only method you would use then? I do, yes. This. Yes, okay. We only use this method. Can you show us again on, on a yeah, different absolutely. part? I mean, we're going to go a little bit lower down this time. Okay. And wow. then the best part after the treatment is done, yeah. we get to rescan the area. So that way, we get to see before and after. Oh, so you can actually see the, the second lines are, are where they're sitting now. That's right. Wow, so you can see before and after how you're actually doing. That shows you a difference, right? That's right. And uh, it does actually look a lot better. So again, without getting to the details of it, but we do get to see. The, but the great thing is that both the patient and the doctor well, get to I'm, see. I'm looking at it, and I can see the two spine columns. The first one has much stronger, yeah. almost like, uh, like a V almost, or but the second one is a lot smoother and rounder. Mm -hmm. Is that you what you're got looking it. for? You got it. Exactly. That's what you it's want. just that simple. Yeah. yeah. No no misalignments. Exactly. Okay. So who can who would benefit from this type of chiropractic care? Well, you know, like we said, everybody has a spine. So everybody has back, neck pain. You know, so we treat a lot of that, chronic conditions, things like headaches, um, but especially people who just don't like the twisting or turning. Mm -hmm. It's not to say one is better than the other, but some people just can't tolerate it mm -hmm. or they don't like it. So that's, you know, the number one reason people don't right. go to chiropractors sometimes. So that's really the people who benefit from it. Now, do you teach your patients about what they see on the screen? Because yes. part of it is also educating them about what's going on in their body. Absolutely. In, in our clinic, we are very big on education because the more you know, the more you can better take care of yourself and your body, make the right educated yeah. health care decisions. So how we do that is, let's say you have a problem at your mid-back here. Okay. So what we want to do is we pull it up oh, onto wow. the screen. Wow. So all the educational material is right here on the screen as well. So if I've got a problem in the low back, I can blow up this area here, show the patient where their nervous system problems may be coming from or where their joint problems may be coming from. Oh, that, uh... And so that way they can see why they're getting pain, not only just in the area where it hurts, yeah. but maybe somewhere else. I love that, that you can actually see where it's happening. And I think this mm -hmm. helps Luke, because so, I think that even today there's still some mystique about chiropractic and it's Absolutely. just bending and cracking. So, so this really gives the client the real idea of what's going on. That's right, and it's clear and it's concise and easy to understand for everybody. Mm -hmm. So that's the best part, both the patient and the doctor can see. Okay, What's going on? can you actually take a step to your left? There, we sure. can see your face now. Um, so at your clinic in Stouffville, yes. if people are 
you know, they know they have pain. Maybe they're not feeling the best that they could be feeling. Yes. Why would you suggest chiropractic for, you know, ailments like headaches? Yeah. For ailments? Well, often, you know? because, you know, honestly, people come to chiropractors as last resorts. They've been to the medical doctors. Right. They've been to the neurologists. They've been told their CT scans or MRIs or X-rays show nothing. And in that case, it probably is a chiropractic problem because their spine isn't as moving as well as it should be. There's stiffness there. There's pressure yeah. on the nerves. So... Um, so in that case, chiropractic care can get to the bottom of the problem instead of giving a Band-Aid solution. Because mm -hmm. you can cover it up with drugs. I can, you can get the Band-Aid from somebody else. Right. But eventually that Band-Aid is going to fall off. Okay. And so that's really how chiropractic care differs in general. We want to get to the source of the problem, correct it, and get rid of your problem that way. What about way. self chiropractor who cracks the neck and adjusts the back every day? Is mm -hmm. that causing a benefit or is that hurting a little? You know, I do believe chiropractic, whether you do it manually, whether you do it with another type of instrument, whether you, whether you do it this way, it all works. Mm. But we just prefer using this method because I used to do manual adjusting and now I do the pro adjuster. I've had over two and a half years of clinical experience. I've probably treated hundreds of patients, delivered thousands of adjustments. And I just know for me personally and the results I get, they're great. Yeah. Can you ever just look at a patient like the one we have now yes. and by just touch, can you feel if there's a misalignment or anything that's not right? Yeah, absolutely. We still use palpation. We still use what we call the older ways of doing it because those are tried and true ways as well. Right. Right. This just delivers the next level of getting to the bottom of the problem for us anyways. So I still do my orthopedic testing. I will still send patients for x-rays. Um, but yes, so we do use the instrument and we use our hands still. Oh, I love it. And I love yeah. that people can actually see what's going on in their yeah, own body yes. and why you know she's working on a certain part. It's really all about education at the end of the day. Uh, if you'd like to stop by the clinic, it's located in Stouffville, Ontario, 905-591-2591. Or go to the uh, website advancedchiro.ca. We'll be right back with more on the show.